right, it is day 37, packing up all my stuff um, in the hotel. I am officially saying goodbye to my uh, mat that I thought well, it was going to be a good choice. Um, however, that's gotten completely shredded. So I uh, picked up basically a just one of the foam uh, folding mats from Walmart. Um, a little heavier, which, you know, add extra weight. That's exactly what I need to do. Um, and bulkier, but um, very much looking forward to having something that I can't feel all the sticks and rocks through, that chunks are not ripping off as well and going through over bushes. So, you know, all of that is gonna be a good thing. So, yay. Right? All right, getting ready to leave Hiker Town and uh, start our uh, Desert Eliakuta walk. All right, goodbye, Hiker Town. Get ready to head out. All right, we're starting. Like dead. LA Aqueduct. Now we follow this <laughs> for several miles. Oh, hey! Hey! <laughs> Alright. On the Aqueduct. sunny but gorgeous. Um, we'll see. We're going to look like a bus go. 17 and a half. Some of us might stop at uh, 15. So we'll see. The sign! Hiking on gobble for the turkeys! Gobble 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 hear me with the wind but I love Joshua trees we're in there everywhere okay Plankton you can go around me it's windy it is windy Ow. good morning it is day 38 um, just left camp uh, probably about a mile back um, I am experiencing a lot of pain in my right um, knee and ankle. Um, it kind of comes in waves um, and then it'll randomly be like sharp shooting. So 
Um, I'm going to get this last two miles to the water source kind of done and then reassess. Um, as you can tell, I'm kind of on a, we're hiking on a dirt road right now. Um, so if after a short rest and some water and all of that, it's not feeling any better, um, I might be trying to reach out to somebody to see if I can get out um, because I think the next out, easily accessible out, is going to be in another 20... It's 26 miles from camp, so 25 miles from here. Uh, so 23 from the water source. Um, so I just kind of need to assess what's going on. Um, it might just be that I need some ice and a break and uh, a little bit of recovery time. Um, it sucks. Um, having to get off. Um, Hopefully it feels better and I can keep going, um, but I also don't want to risk, you know, my knee collapsing. Uh, likes to do that sometimes. Um, so, I don't know. We'll see. Hopefully just a break is all I need and we'll be back on trail and, but at least here, if I need to get off, I've got, hopefully somebody can come up with these dirt roads in the middle of the desert and come get me. Um, we'll see. Check back in later. Okay, I'm entering one of the uh, wind farms here, which I'm in. Totally get. It's so windy through here. Um, get why they stuck them out here. Um, but yeah. We've been seeing these wind farms for the last few days, several days mountains on the other side of the uh, desert yeah, so we knew we were headed this way just took several days to get here in the wind because we're still in the wind farm. Um, some of the wind. But of course I have to be like facing the sun to sit on the side, which is a little annoying. But um, update, I am attempting to try and vendor it to get off trail. Uh, just to rest up my knee. Um, I can feel it kind of twisting while I walk, which is not uh, fun. Uh, <laughs> not really where I want to be. Um, i kind of looking ahead. It's a big climb and 23 more miles until there's another road where I can get off. Um, at least here, I could potentially walk a few miles and get, see if somebody can pick me up on a dirt road out here. Um, I just have a few miles to do. Um, so just kind of waiting. I have in and out cell signal, so I just kind of keep getting it moving around until I have some cell signal to make sure I checking that post uh, that I put in the trail link on Facebook page, seeing if I can get a ride. Um, if I can't, if I don't hear anything in a few hours, um, if I don't get kind of somebody that might be able to get me either today or tomorrow, um, I'll start making my way back towards Hiker Town um, and just kind of go real slow. Um, so it might take me, you know, two days to get back to Hiker Town if my knee is acting up like this, but... It'll be fine. I'll make it somewhere, give my knee a rest, figure out where I'm meeting everybody um, closer to Tachapi, so. Oh well, here we are. Hello, Snake. I need you to go. I don't know what kind of snake you are. I need you to not be on the trail. That would be great. I'd like to walk this way, maybe. Can I startle you? I don't want to scare you. I don't want to startle you, but I, I do want you to maybe notice that I'm here. Hi. I don't know what kind of snake you are, so I don't want to like, you don't have a viper head. So there's some good news there, but like, can you, can you not be in the middle of where I need you to be? Okay. 
Can I, can I go this way? Can I like sneak way around you? Choo -choo. Okay. Goodbye, miss. Goodbye, snake. You're a very pretty snake. Okay. Hopefully you're the only one today. Okay. In a hotel in Tatch, PA, so maybe it's still really sore. Um, did three miles of water and then had enough signal to get on Facebook group. See if I could get it right out. Um, did like two and two and a half back. Um, and Merid was able to come up the road and meet me where I was, which is great. Um, so now I'm here hanging out in the best Western in Tehachapi. Um, we'll leave the group I'm hiking with. It should be getting here tomorrow, if not the next morning. Um, so got a room for one night going to see if there's a cheaper hotel tomorrow. Um, but honestly, like, I don't mind this room. Um, might stay here. Um, I got here and I was starving, but my knee was in so much pain and I didn't want to go anywhere. So, um, I door dashed myself some Taco Bell. So I have some Taco Bell leftovers. Um, I ate some Taco Bell and promptly fell asleep, um, for several hours. So I definitely know that I was in pain. Um, I've been in pain and was hurting and that the miles I did do today were kind of exhaustive, um, based on how hard and deep I slept for those like four hours after I ate some food. Um, so going to chill out, watch some TV, eat my leftover Taco Bell, and then probably go to bed early because I'm still really tired. So just hanging out here. And more, more food and town time. All right, good morning. It's day 40. As you can tell, I'm still the hotel. Um, the other people I second with got in yesterday. Um, taking a zero today, so I get a double zero, which is good. My knee still kind of hurts, so um, I'm going to do some short miles tomorrow. Maybe only do like nine or ten and just see how I feel, um, and then go from there. Um, we're going to keep going on to Ridgecrest for now and then figure out what our plan is for uh, getting off and getting further south to do make up some miles instead of doing it from here, so check in later. We're going to 6,400 feet from 6,200 6, feet. Well, admittedly, once we're up there, that's cool.